Hello and welcome to this brief tutorial on port forwarding. Uh, port forwarding basically uh, tells your router which IP uh, on the local area network to send data to. Uh, don't forget setting up a port for uTorrent for instance. Uh, means you can only use that port for uTorrent on the, the, uh, the IP address that you set it up to use. Otherwise uh, you might uh, mess up the data being sent. So if I'm setting up uh, uTorrent on port 55600 on this IP address, it will only work on this IP address, local IP address uh, for uTorrent, as one port can only be used by one program. Uh, before we s do anything uh, proper, we just want to go to CMD and we want to check what our local IP address is. Uh, we do that by typing in IP config, and we have here IP address, and we see it's 1002. Uh, for you, I'll probably say IP address IPv4. Uh, just not uh, remember that or note it down. Once you have that, you want to get into your router. You do that by typing in the IP address of your router, which is 192.168.1.1, and then you put in your username and password. So we can log in. Now every page is going to look a little bit different, uh, basically I can't tell you where to go, you just want to look for NAT, which stands for Network Address Translation. Uh, click on that, wherever it is, just have a little, if you can't see it directly, maybe it's in one of these uh, expandable things. Once you've done that, you want to actually get into the page where you can set something up. What I have to do is click on Virtual Server, and then here I can set up my port. So, as you can see, I've already set it up, um, so I will select that and delete it and show you how to do it. Okay, so uh, for the rule index, you can choose whichever one here that's not being used. And then application, you can basically just type in any name you want. So as we're using it for uTorrent, I'll type in uTorrent. Here, you don't necessarily have to fill anything. Uh, for protocols, you want to do all, and then where it has start port, you just type in the port number that we had, which was 55600. As you can see, it's already been put in for us, because I did it before. Okay, and then with local IP address, you just type in the IP address IPv4, so it would be 10.0.2.15 which I hope is also there already. There we go. Uh, once I've filled all of that information in, I just click Submit, and port forwarding has now been set up for uTorrent on port 55600. Um, I hope this helped you out. Uh, if you have any problems with port forwarding on your router, just let me know and I'll help you out with it. Um, as always, thanks for watching.